First at five, a grisly discovery in the trunk of a car. A 28-year-old woman's body was found. Now, an Aloha man is in police custody. Fox Bell's Jamie Wilson joins us live from one of the scenes related to the case. Jamie? Well, Pete, tonight deputies are calling this murder, and while they're not sharing a lot of details with us, we do know that this home on 166th place in Aloha is related to the investigation. It's been taped off all day, and cops are zeroing in on that gray house, and it all started with a tip they got yesterday. Well, horrible and shocking, but as I just mentioned to you, with crap that's going on everywhere, it seems like it's just not too surprising. Mike McHugh was at home in Aloha last night when deputies converged on his neighborhood. Cops say they got a tip about a murder leading them to Southwest Sarala and Hargis Street. That's where they found this BMW and a woman's body in the trunk. The victim is 28-year-old Sarah Zagul from Aloha. Then, around 11 p.m., police say they found the suspect near the intersection of Teal and Murray Boulevard, and they took him into custody. Neighbors can hardly believe it. Because you're always seeing this kind of thing happening elsewhere, you, you wonder if anything like this is ever going to affect your life. And then something like this happens and you, you start wondering even more, you know. Russ Allen lives up the street from this gray house. Deputies won't say how it's connected to the investigation, but they've had it taped off all day with forensic experts on scene. Allen does not know the people who live there, and other than a business they run out of their home, he says they're very quiet. They obviously kept to themselves and, and didn't have a lot of... Uh, issues up to now i mean i've never we've never had anything go on that i know of sarah zagul's facebook page says she was a model actress and she went to psu now neighbors want to know how and why her life ended here it, it is kind of weird when you you uh, see your your neighborhood roped or taped off with that the police caution tape you know that's kind of strange and tonight, investigators are not yet releasing the name of the suspect who is accused or suspected in this case yet. However, they are looking for more tips and information about this woman's death. If you can help, you are asked to call the Washington County Sheriff's Office. Live in Aloha tonight, Jamie Wilson, Fox 12 Voice.